Okay, so for this problem, it says the government of Canada is 90,000, which is this and that. So they're giving us these statements, and we want to determine which is true, which is not. So, yeah, so let's first solve for the quota rate. So for Canada's, Canada's quoted rate equation is always 365 years, whereas the U.S. is always 360 over same for number same placement for the number of years matured times uh the numerator for this second part is the same the maturity price right minus the purchase price same here maturity price Minus purchase price over. Okay, so now this is where it gets tricky, right? So for the denominator, we always have to remember that the purchase price always goes in the middle, right? And for the denominator for US, the purchase, the maturity price is always in the denominator. Okay, so let's solve for both of these. So I'll do. 100,000 minus 100,000 divided by 98,000 times 365 divided by 120 and get 0 0.062. Right? 7, 4, 8. That's for Canada. For this one, it's going to be 100,000 minus 98,000. Right, divide by a hundred thousand times uh, and get point zero six is the quoted rate. Okay, so let's look at our answer choices. Quoted rate for the Canada is yep, that's true. Quoted rate exceeds the quoted rate for this. Yep, that's also true. Now they're talking about annual effective yield rates. Okay, so let's solve for it. So for Canada. Canada first starts off with 98K and then effective yield rate J of the 120 days out of the 365. And once it matures, it becomes 100K. Okay. And for the US Treasury, similar, but time frame is different. It's 120 days over 360 instead. Now let's solve. So I'll do 100,000 divided by 98,000. I'm doing Canada first, by the way. I'm going to move this other side by doing it to the exponential 365 over 120. And I'm going to subtract 1. I'm going to get 0 0.06377. Right. This one is 100,000 divided by 98,000. Up uh, to the 316 divided by 120. And then minus 1. I'm going to get 0 0.06248. Two four. Okay, now an annual effect earned by the garnish is equal to the annual effect. Nope, not equal. Annual effect earned by the government Canada is less than the quoted rate on the. No, that's not true. The annual earned by the U.S. Treasury bill is greater than the quoted rate. Yes, that's true. So C is the answer. A D, D, 